Number eight then from the 2019 Advanced Higher Maths, second order differential equation, but it's appearing earlier in the paper than usual, and it's only five marks, where normally you can get about ten for that, but there'd be more, there'd be much more signs and repeated signs and multiplying by x's and so on. Anyway, find the particular solution to this differential equation given these initial conditions. Well, it's just a homogeneous equation, so there's no particular integral to find. You're just going to kick it off with, what's the auxiliary equation? So that would be m squared plus 11m plus 28 equals 0. Been hopeful here just putting these brackets down, of course, because you could get one where you'd have to use the quadratic formula. Well, that's 7 fourths, and they're both positive, which means that m equals negative 7, and m or m equals negative 4. So that lets you get your complementary function, although in this case, this is your general solution, isn't it? Because that's all that's there. So it's going to be the form of a e to the, I'll put the negative one first, 4x plus b e to the negative 7x. I meant to put a negative 7 there. Now you need to find a and b. Get that from initial conditions. So one initial condition is this. y of 0 is 0. So 0 equals a times e to the 0 plus b times e to the 0. So there you go, they're both 1s. So a plus b equals 0. So they're numerically the same with opposite signs. Now to use the second one, differentiate it. dy by dx negative 4a e to the negative 4x minus 7b e to the negative 7x. So at this time it says dy by dx evaluated at 0 is 9. 9 equals negative 4a e to the 0 minus 7b e to the 0. So here's another equation. I'll write it the other way around. 4a plus 7b equals negative 9. I don't know if there's any advantage in doing that. I probably would rather have had that negative just to add them together. Because normally you use elimination there. But I think just to be contrary here, I'm going to do a substitution, just because I messed up with those signs. So I'm going to substitute 1 and 2, because that's quite easy. Because a is equal to negative b. So 4. So 4 times negative b plus 7b is negative 9. Well, that's 3b. So 3b is negative 9, so b is negative 3. And then straight away from 1, that means a equals positive 3. It's a bit messy, this. Not left enough room for the final answer. It'll just have to go in here, squeezed into here. So what is the particular solution? It'll be, at least there's only two terms, so it will fit in here. y equals 3 e to the negative 4x minus 3 e to the negative 7x.